Hey everyone, so the Cramathon for 2015 has ended for me and I completed a lot of my challenges so I just wanted to share with you a wrap up of everything that I completed over the four day readathon. On day one I read 72 pages of Sons and Lovers by D.H. Lawrence. Then I picked up and finished District and Circle by Seamus Heaney and this was a total of 78 pages. Then I picked up Ariel by Sylvia Plath and I finished this which was a total of 81 pages. I also picked up The Best Poems Ever, a collection of poetry's greatest voices edited by Edric S. Mesmer, and this was 71 pages. I also picked up and finished Tom Stoppard's Plays 1, which includes The Real Inspector Hound, After Marguerite, Dirty Linen, Newfoundland, Dobbs Hamlet, Coots Macbeth, and this was a total of 211 pages. And lastly, right before I went to bed, I picked up Winnie the Pooh by A.A. A. Milne, which was a total of 161 pages. So on day one, I read six books and completed five for a total of 674 pages read. On day two, I picked up and started The Little World of Elves and Fairies, an anthology of verse with illustrations by Ida Rintoul Uthwaite. This was 58 pages long. I then picked up and finished The Elements of Style Illustrated by Strunk, White and Kalman, and this was about 150 pages. Then last Lastly, on day two, I picked up the Best Australian Poems of 2010, edited by Robert Adamson, and this was 213 pages. So on day two, I read three books for a total of 421 pages. I didn't do too well on day three. I re-picked up Sons and Lovers and read another 45 pages. And I also completed three plays by John Arden, The Waters of Babylon, Live Like Pigs, and The Happy Haven, which was a total of 272 pages. So on day three, I only read 317 pages. And then lastly, on day four, I read The Domesticity of Giraffes by Judith Beveridge, and this was 80 pages. And I also picked up and then finished a few minutes after midnight, but I'm still going to count it as read on day four, Teacher Man by Frank McCourt, and this was a total of 258 pages. So on day four, I read 338 pages. Unfortunately, there were some books that I was planning on reading and I didn't actually pick up at all. The first was Ted Hughes' New Selected Poems from 1957 to 1994, Terminus by Mark O. Rowe, Tennessee Williams' Sweet Bird of Youth, A Streetcar Named Desire, and The Glass Menagerie, H.G. Wells' The War of the Worlds, Nine Poets, edited by F.J. Alsop and O.W. Hunt, and Friends, Kafka, Metamorphosis, and Other Stories. So while I didn't manage to pick up or finish any of those, I am hoping to read them over the next month. So at the end of the four day Cramathon readathon, I read a total of 12 books, I finished 11 of them, and in total I read 1750 pages. So I'm pretty proud of all of that. I made a really big dent in my to be read shelves, even though um, you'll be seeing later this week when I post a haul, I picked up a lot of books from a secondhand book sale during the same weekend, so it didn't really even out unfortunately. And even though I said that I wasn't going to complete any of the challenges, I did complete most of them. So so I thought I would share that with you. The first one was to read a children's book, which I did with Winnie the Pooh by A. A. Milne. The second was to read a hardback, which I did with District and Circle. The third was to read two books in 24 hours, and I did that on day one, day two, and day four. The fourth challenge was to read a graphic novel. Unfortunately, I didn't complete that challenge. The fifth was to read a novel in verse, and while I didn't read any verse novels per se, I did read six collections of poetry, so I am going to Count that as done because I think I read enough first to compose an entire novel. Six was to read a novella and I also didn't complete this one, but number seven was to read five books in total and I read a total of 11, so I think I did complete that challenge. So there you go, those are all the books that I read during the 2015 Cramathon Readathon. If you participated in this readathon, please let me know how you did um, and let me know what you read during the readathon. But otherwise, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye.